Loads of students on the daily basis ask me like what types of questions are asked in the front end interviews. So I created a mock interview series. I ask the questions to the candidate and candidate give answers to me. And in this mock interview series, you can see I ask machine coding question, core JavaScript question, output based question, and some HTML and CSS questions too. And I have created one more series where I talk about like uh, you can prepare the front end machine coding round. But even after watching or learning these two series, they want to practice more. They want to know ways to practice HTML, CSS, JavaScript, interview question. So if you're also want to learn HTML, CSS, JavaScript from interview point of view, and you want to solve output based question, core um, JavaScript or HTML, CSS question, so that you can give answers in the interview. So I'm going to launch my latest series, front end interview question. In this series, we are going to talk about HTML, CSS, JavaScript, React in depth. So let's say, uh, let me give an example of HTML. So generally, HTML questions are not asked in the interview, but they can ask as a warm up question before going to the JavaScript or the React JS question. They can ask, and if you're not able to answer the basic question on HTML, that will give a negative uh, impression of you. So do you want to like give a negative impression? No. So you have to prepare the HTML interview questions too. So like there can be something like what types of tags are introduced in the HTML5? Do you know about the web worker in the HTML5? Do you understand about the geolocation API, inline and block element? What is the difference between the tags and the attribute? So we are going to learn about this kind of uh, question. We are going to understand how to answer this. If you are a beginner, then how much answer will be like valid? If you are advanced, like you have a two years or three years of experience, then what should be your answer? So, because interview will not accept the same answer from the fresher and the two, three or two year of experience person. So, depending on your experience, you have to give your answer. Okay. So, we are going to learn about the HTML, CSS. On JavaScript, what I am planning to do in JavaScript, let's say if I pick a topic, let's say a promise. So, in promise, there can be many output based questions and many more like set timeout related questions too. So we are going to solve, if I pick a topic, I will solve all the question, all possible question that can be interview may ask. So if you want to make like more such video and want to practice, so do let me know in the comment section. And if you want certain topics that I should introduce in this series, do let me know. And this kind of series will take lots of lots of research because I have to read lots of most interview ask question from the books, from the videos, from the blogs, from the articles, so I have to do lots of research. So make sure uh, to show some support. Do like and uh, do drop the comment and share this video with everyone, with your friends, with your college group, so that I can make such more videos in the future. So this is it for the, this video. I will see you in the first video of front end interview question.